Hey guys, this is Hillbilly the Mouse Man here, coming at y'all with a late mouse review. Man, I bought this mouse back in, when it first came out, I'd say about eight months ago, seven months ago, and I loved the mouse, but I had one problem with the mouse. And this is only gonna pertain to you if you play Fortnite. I have bought five, six copies of this mouse, and they all do the same thing, is the scroll wheel. When you scroll down reset with this mouse, it gets stuck. Not every time, but it's probably like every few times it gets stuck. Like when you just go like this is to reset your builds, it hangs in the edit. The wired version doesn't do that. I'm a wireless fanboy, so I haven't played with the wired wired one. So I just don't get why. And I, I've just bought this one, right? Because I'm like, okay, it's been like eight months. Let's see if it was maybe an issue, a scroll wheel issue. And they, and they fixed it, and they still do it. But with this mouse, man, I'm going to tell you what this mouse is packing. It's got these quick strike buttons that feel amazing. It has a marksman sensor that goes to 25,600 DPI. The simper spot on, it's it's up a little up a little high. It's it's more positioned towards the front. Has these PTFE skates. It glides good. I don't have a problem with any kind of rubbing. I don't have any problem with any kind of build quality. I mean, you could squeeze it, it's solid. It comes in about 81 grams. I mean, it's a solid mouse. And honestly, if you're playing any game but Fortnite, or if you don't use scroll down reset like this mouse is a really good mouse my aim is really good with this mouse i like the i like how it's fatter in the back and then comes slopes in a little bit i like that about this mouse i feel like corsair has something here i feel like the scroll wheel issue it's weird because like you don't it doesn't bother you in any other game because they're defined enough to where you can swap to your guns if you don't have if you don't have your guns on your numbers, like you can use them for one actions. It's just for Fortnite. So unless you use scroll down reset in Fortnite, then this mouse is a shoe in. It's probably the second best ergonomic mouse in my opinion, mainly because it doesn't have holes. First one to me is the Death Adder. This one coming in at second. Um, I just feel like Corsair has something here, and coming from Corsair, who usually builds a lot of weird mouse mouses or mice it's a good product like it's a fire product it has 2000 hertz pulling uh i never tried it at that i feel like that's i mean you don't need it so i never really tried the 2000 um just same thing like i, I run the huntsman v2 keyboard i've never put it at 8000 because it, to me it's just not needed but it, it's solid it, it's it has sensor clarity i mean it feels real smooth the battery lasts for a good while. I think it says 70 hours. So the, the slipstream, you can have a bunch of, like if you have a wireless headset, you have a wireless mouse with Corsair, you can all put them on the same dongle, which is really awesome. But other than that, man, this mouse is really good. If you play Valorant, because I do dibble dabble in Valorant, and I feel like this could be my main Valorant mouse. Um, it, It's solid. It's It feels good. It doesn't feel cheap. The coating to me, some people say slippery, but I feel like it's, it feels good, man. And of course you get your one little RGB back here. You got these little black, darker black stripes right here and up here. And I feel like they could have done away with that and just made it all this, uh, this gritty texture, but they didn't. But I mean, it really doesn't affect me in game. The side buttons are positioned good. I mean, it is solid. I mean, USB-C charging. I mean, it's great. It's a great mouse and I recommend it to you. Like I said, unless you play Fortnite and you scroll down reset. But man, with that, I would just want to say appreciate y'all, man. I, I really appreciate all the support I've been getting on my channel. I'm sorry this mouse, I mean, this is an eight month late review, but I was waiting to see if the build quality had changed on them. Um, because at, at that time I only played Fortnite, so I thought the mouse was garbage. But now that I've been dibble dabbling in Valorant, a little bit of Warzone, I have different opinions on the mouse. I'm just saying if you scroll down reset, don't use the mouse for Fortnite. So any other game, great mouse i totally recommend it behind the death adder it's kind of just personal preference on which shape you like better i've used the death adder more i think it's a little more comfortable but this mouse is mega comfortable it fills out the hand i mean you can claw it and it and it puts it right back there in your palm you can palm it, it i mean it just feels good you can't fingertip it unless you i mean unless you were shack but other than that man i say go for it don't let other reviews pipe you down i know a lot of people like giving corsair a lot of slack Corsair is a good company. I feel like Corsair keyboards are some of the best keyboards. So I'm, they need to step their mouse game up a little bit. But I think this one was a, a in the very good right direction. And I can't wait to see what else, what other mice Corsair come out with. 
But man, with that being said, remember, I love you. God loves you more. Peace, guys. Catch you in the next review.